Hi everybody, in this video we're going to look at our auto tracking camera for live streaming. All this and more coming up next. So Huddlecam HD has a brand new auto tracking camera I'm using right now called the Simple Track. And one of the reasons why I wanted to show it in our video background set here is because it's really nice for auto tracking. And a lot of people for live streaming are trying to up their game and create really great live stream sets. Well, let's take a look at the John Oliver television show. You see this a lot. You see how the camera slowly tracks him left to right. Uh, it's a really high end uh, videography, video production technique to make the, the audience, the millions of people that are watching, feel engaged and kind of follow him. So if you fade back to where I am now, you can see that I can actually have the camera just slowly left to right follow me automatically without having to hire someone for fifty to seventy thousand dollars a year to just be a camera operator. So you can see I'm going left to right and here's actually a live view of the camera in a picture in picture so you can see just how smooth it is in the sensitivity of this product it brings out HD SDI so you can put it into a traditional video broadcast switcher and it also can do USB 3.0 with the included frame grabber so you can use it for video conferences or live streaming software like Wirecast or vMix, XSplit or open broadcast software. So I've kind of shown the demo. We really, this can follow teachers all left and right. We're going to look at the software in a moment here. But let me show you it on a tripod really quickly. Um, it's also very mobile. So uh, you can just set it up right on a tripod there and the cables come right down the, the, uh, the bottom and you can remotely control it over your network and have all of the 1080p up to 60 frames per second video there. Let me show you on a ceiling. This is another great option for permanently installed situations where you might want to have that. And then finally, let me show you the software here. Um, the software is, is very advanced and I'm going to kind of take you through this um, step by step here. The first thing you'll see is the camera list. So here's the camera list here and if you are a large organization, a university or a broadcast television network that you want to have these auto tracking cameras in, you can see a full list of every camera on your network. Uh, we can zoom in and out as needed. Um, but it's going to, depending on the tracking setting that we have it set to, it's going to want to lock into the layout that we have chose. Um, you got white balance, camera presets. I can start and stop tracking. I'll go ahead and stop tracking for a moment. It'll lock into the preset that we have positioned. And I want to show you the advanced settings here because this is something that uh, really takes it above and beyond anything else on the market. Over here on the right hand side here, look at the sensitivity. So I actually had the tracking sensitivity set extremely high. Um, so I can take that down a little bit, maybe to five. I can have the pan speed go down a little bit. And this actually allows us to kind of get even closer to um, you know what you would see from a real cameraman. So we have the pan speed down, we have the track sensitivity down. Um, we've got our object lost preset. If for some reason you know someone was moving around very quickly, we could have a, a fallback preset. Let's go ahead and click OK. And let me take you back to our uh, main setup here, our main feed. Um, and that will show in a second. That's the IP video that kind of glitched out there. I'll take us back to the main feed. And now that we've changed the sensitivity, and I got actually I got to hit the uh, track button. Okay, I'm gonna forget that hit the start tracking button. Now look how very nice and slowly it will PTZ. So it's a very, very nice and slow, exactly what you would see on the John Oliver show or something on television. And this is a camera that's only $6,000 that you can get into a television studio and not have to worry about hiring a high-end, um, you know, camera operator. So these are really great for eliminating the need for camera operators and that's the whole point of these. And that's it. If you'd like a demo, we have demo units available. We'd be happy to do a live demo or you can jump into one of our webinars, but it's a great product that we'd love to share with you guys. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like this button if you want to see more from Huddlecam HD. Click to watch another exciting Huddlecam HD video and don't forget to subscribe. Huddlecam HD conference cameras are made for meetings that matter. Tune in Fridays at 10 a.m. Pacific, 1 p.m. Eastern to join our live show with new industry experts and video conferencing tutorials every week.